Adapting the hit video game series Fallout isn't easy, but veteran filmmaker Jonathan Nolan is more than up to the task. Co-creating the series with longtime collaborator Lisa Joy, Nolan brings an irradiated wasteland in the ruins of the United States to life. The Prime Video project is filled with plenty of recognizable sites for fans of the games, yet completely accessible for unfamiliar audiences. Joining the production is another Nolan collaborator, actor Michael Emerson, who has a recurring role in Fallout as the eccentric scientist Wilzig. In an interview with CBR, Person of Interest and Westworld co-creator Nolan and Emerson explain the appeal of diving into the world of Fallout ahead of its April 11, 2024 premiere. They also share how they found an effective balance between humor and violence in the series. The duo further hint at the nuances and complexities of Wilzig and how he reacts to life in the wasteland. CBR, it's clear from the series premiere that Fallout isn't pulling its punches in terms of violence. How did you capture the brutality of the wasteland while still making an accessible pilot? Jonathan Nolan, we took the T-Fallout games as our yardstick and waypoint. I remember my experience playing Fallout 3 for the first time, which was my first encounter with the series. The beginning of that game is so rich and immersive. You're learning about the world and everything, and then you leave the vault for the first time, and you encounter raiders for the first time. You start to realize just how insanely violent this universe is, which makes sense. That collision of tones, to me, was so exciting from the games. We knew we had to bring that to the series, that moment of going, whoa. There are a couple good doses of that to make sure that people understand what they're getting into. Fallout is a playground of different genres, from Mad Max-esque wasteland and western to 1950s science fiction. How did you blend all these elements together into a single, cohesive world? Nolan, it's all the good stuff. All the best stuff. One thing that I was struck by from the games was how could it be all of my favorite things all in one. That was the cocktail that we tried to bring into the series. It wouldn't be incorrect to call Wilzig a bit of a mad scientist, albeit in a world gone mad so he's somewhat ahead of the curve. Michael, how did you bring dimension to your character? Michael Emerson, it was fine. Laughs. I just identify with a character like that. He's living in a world that he knows is wrong and in a vault that's cruel and a little fascistic. He's aware, somehow, of the miserable lives being led on the surface and I think he feels that he has a mission, a moral duty, perhaps, to do something for, people, instead of leaving them up there to disintegrate. A lot of your scenes are with Ella Purnell's character Lucy, almost serving as a guide to the realities of the wasteland. How would you describe working with Ella? Emerson, I love her. She's really open and a great listener. I require good listeners in my work. Laughs. We had a ball. She's really game and upbeat, I have to say. It's nice when the people who are the lead characters set a tone like that, of playfulness and good humor. That goes a long way with me. How was filming Fallout in Namibia, creating such expansive and vast environments?